If you have just started Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain, and you're still fairly early into the game, there's an unlockable feature that you probably want to rush towards. It's the Gunsmith Weapon Customization, and I wish I knew about it earlier. So seriously, consider putting down those side quests and unlock the Gunsmith ASAP. Without spoiling too much, to unlock this feature, you'll need to complete Mission 13, Pitch Dark, and then completing the three legendary Gunsmith side ops, 107 to 109. Finish these, and you, my friend, are ready to lose hours to gunsmithing. At this point in time, I hope you save some GMP, because if you haven't bought many weapon upgrades already, you're gonna have a tough time using the gunsmith's full potential. The key here is to purchase upgrades in one type of weapon category, i.e. the more assault rifle upgrades you buy, the more custom options you have for that weapon class. So, ideally, conserve GMP to unlock weapon upgrades for classes you wish to gunsmith. And those are your early stages to gunsmithing right there. Try your best to focus on two or more weapon classes. Here I focused on sniper and assault rifle and created two iterations of each, short and long ranged. Here we have an MRS-4 base with an S barrel for high firing speed and extended banana mag clip. Now pair this puppy up with the long ranged M2000D sniper rifle base and a Renoff HP barrel for that extra long range. And then a two to eight times scope. Mm, now we're talking. But here's another scenario. Say you want to carry a rocket launcher or a trank sniper in that second primary slot, but still want to retain long distance sniping. Meet both ways by customizing a longer range assault class rifle. Start off with the longer range UN arc base, attach a Bambatov barrel for some additional range, and then tack on a two times booster optic with a red dot, closing the gap between range and close encounters. Those are just two examples of loadouts you can customize, and that's only at 24% game completion, meaning down the road you're going to find yourself continually shaping and customizing your weapon layouts. If you have any hot combos of your own, put them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and be careful down there, soldier!